Hi, my name is Eldine. Welcome to the Sony booth at CES 2015. And uh, we're in the digital imaging division. And what I'm going to show you over here is a really cool display that we have with some of our cameras. Uh, and as you can see, cameras are getting smaller. Uh, large sensor cameras with very large sensors, uh, kind of like a, um, a DSLR but mirrorless, which is really the future of camera technology. And these have actually surpassed what the uh, traditional DSLR can do. Um, and in particular over here is the focus system on these cameras. So this is the A5100, we have the A6000, we also have an A77 Mark II. And what they have is what we call a uh, dual hybrid AF system, which means that it has contrast and phase detection on the sensor that covers about 90% of the sensor itself. What essentially that means is that these cameras can shoot up to 10 and 12 frames per second and focus very accurately and capture almost every single shot in, in, in you know, perfect focus. And that really helps anybody who's out shooting. Let's say you have kids running around or you're shooting sports. Um, you, you really don't get any missed shots. So uh, look out for the uh, new Alpha system cameras, uh, A5100, uh, the A6000, and uh, a few others that I'm going to take you to show you in a, in a few seconds. So, um, so here on the A5100 we have a, a, a touch screen display that's articulating. You can flip it over so you can do selfies. It's obviously an uh, interchangeable lens camera. I can't take this one off right now because the alarm is going to go off. Uh, you've got a pop-up flash. Obviously it shoots uh, uh, full HD video as well. And this one will go up to 10 frames a second. So in a uh, you know, very high resolution, very fast camera, super fast focusing. And then over here, sorry, we have a very similar camera. Now this is the uh, A6000. The only difference with the A6000 is that uh, it has a little extra on the top, uh, two dials. It also has an OLED uh, XGA viewfinder, a hot shoe, still has the pop-up flash. And then uh, shooting in very high speed with these cameras. And that'll just carry on going really fast uh, shooting speed, very fast focusing. Also, the cameras have Wi-Fi and NFC, so you can uh, sync these up with a smartphone, iOS or Android, so Apple or Android. And uh, you can not only control the, the uh, uh, camera from your phone, but you can also transfer your images. So if you're out shooting, and you don't have a Wi-Fi signal, you don't want to download your pictures, you can take much better photographs on a mirrorless camera than you can on pretty much any other camera, transfer that to your phone, and then upload those uh, directly for uh, instant sharing. Okay. So over here what we have is the uh, A77 Mark II, traditional DSLR body style, 12 frames a second, 24 megapixels, ultra fast as well. So for those folks who like the uh, traditional enthusiast type camera, very cool articulating LCD screen. Again, same uh, XGO OLED viewfinder as you're going to get on the A6000. And obviously a little bit bigger body because it's a traditional DSLR. So again, we're at uh, CES booth. My name is Eldine, and what we're going to show you over here is our new A7 Mark II. And what this is, is a uh, phenomenal uh, mirrorless camera. It's got a full frame, 24 megapixel CMOS sensor. Uh, it has hybrid AF, so it's got contrast and phase detection on AF, which makes it uh, extremely accurate, extremely fast to focus, really great resolution. But on the Mark II, what we've added is a five axis image stabilization on the sensor itself. So typical image stabilization, either on a sensor would be an X, Y axis. Uh, typical uh, image stabilization on a lens would probably be pitch and yaw. Uh, this adds uh, pitch your X, Y and roll stability, which makes this an incredibly stable camera for handheld shooting, probably up to about minus four stops at which you'd normally be able to shoot. So being able to take a very light, easy camera to use, get great image stabilization, even if you put on third-party lenses. All right, so here at uh, CES 2015, we're showing the A7S, and uh, this is uh, paired up to the new Atomos uh, Shogun as showing our output for 4K recording. And uh, what I have here on the A7S, so this is a 12 megapixel mirrorless camera. I paired it up with the 28 to 135 Cine lens. It's a new lens of ours that we announced uh, late last year. Also, it has the XLR box adapter over here, the XLR1. So inside our standard ISO shoe, we have 20 pins that allows you to get uh, uncompressed linear PCM audio as well and use a XLR box for balanced uh, audio.
So what you're seeing here is a, a very dark box. It's probably minus uh, four EV, which is about a quarter candle inside that box. And we have two A7S's brought in. And as you can see, the A7S can actually see what pretty, pretty much uh, you can't see. We're having through this hole and saying, can you see what's inside there? Most people can see that it's inside this is so sensitive that it can actually focus in basically a quarter of a camera and I can bump this all the way up to 490,000 clear so it's only a clear focus on the pretty good signal that's coming out of the camera at 490,000 clear so very easy. And this is I'm shooting at 160 of a second at F1.8. If I was shooting 30p video, for instance, I'd be able to um, essentially get this in low-light situation. I think if I did take a photo of this, I'd be able to see the noise. It's very specific. Yeah, I'll focus on the point. Nice one, like a Yeah, okay. 